when I was 10 years old, I remember coming here and it was a green pathway, green tunnel. And as time progressed, it started to die off. And now it kind of looks like a wasteland with no life at all. This project started when Sebastian made this presentation in science class about the mangroves and what it meant to him. And we looked at each other and got together and started talking about it. And it evolved into helping this, this mangrove. Mangroves are great ecosystems that are home to very famous targeted species. And after doing some research, I saw that mangroves are the nursery grounds for 70% of the commercial fish that we consume. And as mangroves need the ocean's influence to be able to sustain itself, in this case, having so much debris on the floor, the seeds will come in, they won't have a chance to engage with the muck, and then the tides will just pick them up and flush them back out to sea. We took some seeds um, from the beach, and what we did was we started planting them. It's more of a trial and error where you try something, you see if it works, and if it does, you keep going. At the beginning, it was kind of hard on us because they weren't growing, we weren't seeing any progress. We could kind of see the roots through the bottle where they were poking out, but there was no stem or leaf coming out. And towards the end of the year, we finally saw a little sprout in the seed. And then from there, they just skyrocketed actually coming into the mangrove with the plants, with the shovels, being in the muck waist deep, making little holes, putting the plants in. People would walk past us and they would stop and ask, what are you guys doing? And then we would explain our project and why. I just came down and I saw him here, so I just jumped in and he started telling me about the project and I got super excited and it's something that I'm definitely passionate about because I've seen it change and I've just lived here my whole life so I've definitely become attached to it. But it's been really recent since I started working with him and he explained the projects and his ideas and I loved it. We just went into a new collaboration with Connect Ocean. We want to integrate different communities at different schools make a greenhouse so that we can store uh, 1,200 seeds at a time, bring down biologists so they can conduct research on what happened to this mangrove. This project is nowhere near to be done. When I was telling people about this project, and they say, well, how long does it take a mangrove to grow? You're gonna be waiting 20 years till you see a difference, but it's not about seeing a difference right away. It's about knowing that I was able to contribute and inspire other people to do the same and to care about this forest and understand why it's so important so that they can see it grow. And then maybe I'll come back here and maybe it'll be like it was 20 years ago when it was like a green tunnel, which you don't see anymore. That's what I want to create.